Hi, it's Kelly here, and this is part three of how to end the hurricanes in real life and in your life. I hope you love this like I do. All right, the first thing is for some people, a lot of people, they have a hard time remembering something that really brought them joy in their life, or if they had such an experience or many multiple experiences, but then things happen and so they got pushed down where they were no longer seen as joyful. Does that sound familiar? I'm sure we've all done that to something that was joyful to us. So what you can do is either reframe that or you can just make up whatever you would like something joyful to be that is permanent, that you would like to be permanent in your heart you know, as being the most joyful moment of your life. And then when you feel it with your hand lightly on your heart, you let go of the circumstances and just feel the joy rather than whatever it is that you imagine to construct it up. Right? And the second thing, and this is maybe the most important part of all, is that this is absolutely not a one-time thing and it is best used when something is really crappy going on in your life. When that happens, it'll be good to go back to the question that's in my earlier videos, the titled, uh, well, one's titled part two and the other one's right before it. And just go and check those out. And you want to use those. You're going to ask yourself the question so that you can get yourself in a neutral place. Because it might be difficult otherwise. You know, for me, as an example, I do physical therapy generally three times a week. And if you've done physical therapy, you know that it can be uncomfortable to do it because you're stretching things, you're trying to get muscles that are stuck to move, and that requires a little bit of stretching in order to, to break up the crystallizations and what have you in there. And they're not necessarily what we would consider fun, right? So what I do sometimes is that I use this technique and say, what if this were to become my most joyous experience in my entire life? And then I drop the circumstances and I do the exercise. And it works. There are some of the exercises where I have to hold something for like 30 seconds and do it multiple times. And the time flies by so much so that after the 30 seconds, if I feel like I didn't do the technique quite properly, I'll add extra time, 5, 10, 15 seconds to the exercise to get it to go for me well. And it does, and I do. So those are the two things. And also go back and watch the videos, the earlier videos if you're not familiar. And uh, of course this is sponsored by my books. Over here is The Doctor Cures Cancer. And then you've got uh, Is There a Question That Heals Instantly? You'll see, you'll see the titles listed down below. They're available to Amazon. And uh, just love you so much and hope you're doing well and that you can do this and you'll find yourself, you'll start praying unceasingly and we'll have just a great world. You take care. God bless.